We're getting a new honey badger. Ooh. Ooh. After all these years, Tarballs has finally received an update, and the name is now changed to Tarball Simulator. Most likely to make fun of Tower Defense Simulator. Now, there is a lot of new stuff. There is so much new stuff. Planet made this big document about what is exactly added. Basically, what you need to know is that Golden Commando, Golden Scout are for sale, and there's a new, t uh, three new towers: Plasma Trooper, Huntsman Tower, and Tweeter Tower. Uh, and there's also a, a two new waves and and a quite a few new zombies. And, yep, the name is now Tower Battle Simulator. It's no longer just Tower Battles. It's Tower Battle Simulator. With that name, it'll probably be more better. But yes, there's a new tower right there. I have, I, I think I have the Huntsman as well. Nope, I don't have it. I just saw my Golden Commando Towers. Okay, time for music. Now, to go in and redeem a code, look in the bottom left corner. You put a quote in here. Now, the code is update in a minute 2019. Then when you click enter, you get the Twitter code redeemed. Twitter tower. And there's a scout with a Twitter thing. And you follow Planet Earth Roblox if you want to get more codes. You're not really doubt he's going to do that. Now, let's go and see the stats. I got the Twitter tower now. And it looks like it's the exact same thing as a it is the exact same thing as a scout, except that it's it's basically another meme of Red Scout. Puzzle Trooper, I'm going to purchase. I have used this in a testing thingy, and there we go. Now it worked. I have used um oh wait, there's no testing place. How lied. <laughs> this tower is really cool. I'm going to equip it now. This dude really took this dude really took a Minecraft music remix as a lobby music. He really took Minecraft music as a remix and put it in the main menu. Wow. Just wow. But if you guys didn't know, there's also a lot of towers buff in there. Uh, fun fact, me and Ryan uh, told Planet to buff and nerf those about six months ago. Six months later, they are finally being used. How cool is that? That is super cool. Uh, for all these use, yeah, sh uh, shotgunners and fr uh, and fraggers are now useful, and also soldier. I forgot the rest of the towers that we buffed, but we looked at every single tower that needed a buff, and Golden Commando got nerfed again. No, Nerf Commando got nerfed and buffed. So prices increased, but the rate of fire is also increased, and barracks is uh, also nerfed. And like, there's just so much stuff. There's like so much stuff. Holy crap! Oh, the biggest thing is that lag is now fixed. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be perfect representation of uh, how lag is fixed, but yes, now lag is fixed. Uh, I'm not really sure how, but we will see how it is fixed. By the way, Golden Commando and Golden Scout do have wins. Uh, a lot of wins that they need. I think Golden Commando has like 250. Uh, yeah, Golden Commando has 250 trophies requirement, and Golden Scout has only 150 go uh, trophy requirement. To be honest, Golden Scout is definitely not worth it, but Golden Commando is for sure worth it, so be sure to pick up the Golden Commando and I'm not sure if these towers are permanent or not. So, yeah. Uh, Huntsman Tower for now is only earned through tournaments. Fun fact. Um, Ryan uh, is here. Yay, I'm going to play with him. You guys, you, well, most of you probably don't remember him. Uh, wow, Planet Earth is not giving me. I literally, mine, my game will always, my aim. Yeah, okay, yeah, your keyboard typing skills will, will always be better, yeah. Ah, I got Huntsman Tower, guys. Ah! <laughs> Alright, uh, now we're in the game with uh, Ryan planning the gang's all here. Yay! They have tags that I should have because I because I did tests as well. By the way, there is also a new thingy where you where you can veto maps and it also tells you to track length. However, it doesn't give you a higher reward for doing shorter track lengths. So it's just simply harder, which is kind of dumb. Uh, start now. You can also vote that to skip the timer thingy. Just, yeah, do it, do it. Do oh, you can also revoke your vote as well. That's dope. And you can also veto the map that you don't want as well. But uh, Borderlands is clearly one of the best maps in the game. I'm going to put it in the Plasma Tower when I can't afford it. Uh, for now, like the cheapest tower I have is actually the Huntsman Tower. That's the cheapest tower I can afford now. Uh, my main tower to go to right now is Golden Commando. And I'm going to back it up with, uh, with Huntsman. Because Huntsman is actually OP. Because uh, it gives out... Oh yeah, is that Stunner? Cool, yeah, uh, that's a, a that's a exclusive tower right there. Oh, well, an exclusive tower right there. Does a very crappy job. Like, it does stun, yeah, but that's about it. Anyways, uh, I guess it was back to the normal tower halls thingy. I'm not sure how long this will last, though, like, as in the pipe. Because I'm like, Plaza Tower and ha and Hawthorne Tower and Golden Scout and Golden Command. Those are four new towers and one new update. 
Um, to be honest, Golden Scout and Golden Commandos are not new. Uh, I had them for like a year, so yeah. I think I, yeah, I had Golden Scout for like a year. But there's also a knife right there, but uh, these are locked towers that we can even have ourselves. So that's pretty cool. I tried to flex my channel on him, but he didn't care. By the way, Huntsman Tower is very OP as in terms of range. Like, uh, in testing server, I would actually place it right here and then, ma and then max it out. And it would reach all the way over here. Alright, this is the Huntsman Tower right here. And it fires in a long burst and does like around 10 damage or something like that. So yeah, it's pretty dope. I'm going to uh, get the long shot upgrade. I should have placed it right here because I know how well it does. But yeah, now I'm going to be doing super OP. And the cool thing about this tower is that it's almost like a farm. Because when you buy payday, the tower itself gives income for free. So that's why this tower is pretty OP. Because uh, these are not only good for like mid to late game but they also give you back money as well which is really dope guys planet earth copy tower defense simulator heat stunner tower is in tower defense simulator whoa guys whoa by uh huntsman does not detect stealth at the wait i think it wait it should because i remember killing a bunch of stealth dudes hold on wait. stealth dudes do get detected by huntsman so nice uh, here's a plaza tower. It um targets like five targets at once. Why isn't that working right now? So, this is a new uh, tower. By the way, I helped Planet design that little part right there because he wanted oh what? Oh, because he wanted the man to stand like on the side, and I was like, oh, that's pretty stupid. Why not put it on top? And that looked also stupid as well, but less stupid. Okay, uh, Huntsman deals like about 15 damage per burst or something like that, which is pretty dope as well. I'm gonna get the payday thingy, and now every 50 seconds I get $250 back, which is super nice, bro. It's just super nice. Look at that tower, man. Look at that tower. That is hot right there. Right, I got $10 million now, so now I, I can actually map, I can actually max out some towers and stuff like that. I'm gonna uh, get the plasma towers, so here's what the first level looks like. It looks like that. Oh, wait, I'm actually gonna put this in the front. Uh, so it can do some cool stuff. So it targets three towers at the same time. I mean, I have three zombies, my bad, at the starting level. CT goggles increases range, shorter wavelength increases damage, I think, or does like more waves or something like that. Plaza Tower looks even more dope. And then Light Bubble of Doom, which has pretty good range as well. Look how fast we shred. We're like one shining slows right here. This is how OP this tower is. That's how OP this tower is. Um, I forgot. Uh, I went AFK, then we died, and now Planet and Ryan doesn't want to play anymore. I'm pretty sure they ditched me on purpose, so I won't be surprised if they actually did it on purpose. Because I'm pretty sure we all we all had a million cash, and we should have survived just fine. But they let me die on purpose. So now I have to play it legitly. By the way, Huntsman at level 1 is actually really good. I'm like, as these guys you can see, I'm like just shredding through these guys pretty dang fast. And uh, Jeep is also pretty good as well. With these two combos, they're pretty much unsupple for, for quite some time. Huntsman Tower is honestly a very cheap tower for and like it does like a lot of damage for the price you give for it. And it, it also becomes a farm tower later on in the game when you get payday and stuff like that uh, for it. <clears throat> Patrol is also buff by the way. There's like so many towers that are buff, so you should honestly just check it out for yourself. Um, Patrol is buff. Level 3 uh, death explosion and uh, damage buff is now buffed to 20 instead of 5. Uh, health for level 4 is now buffed to 90, and the damage is also increased, bullet damage, and, uh, and health for the tank is also increased by 50, which is not a whole lot, and the same thing with the, uh, damage for it as well. By the way, Mo uh, Motor did get nerfed, it got nerfed 10 damage, and also costs like $1,000 more, so, yeah, that's cool. I'm glad it got nerfed, especially for, uh, even though with, uh, Versus, you technically didn't need farms, it was still a little bit uh, easy to get money with the farm. Okay, shut up, cool. So now uh, there's a <laughs> there's a bunch of new towers uh, with new stra uh, with new strategies. Uh, Cause all the old ones they are kind of ruined a bit. They may or may not work. Cause I'm like the the strats now are going to be changed. Cause there's so many tower buffs and nerfs in the farm also got nerfed as well. So yeah, just be wary of that. Don't always try the same strategy. Like uh, I think now you can't wait until wave five to place it on commando because um that got nerfed uh because uh speedies are faster like they spawn more or so or something like that and that was to prevent just simply waiting for commando so yeah have fun with that but there's new sound effects to zombies as well such as when mysteries die they have a broken glass effect which is pretty cool i guess i want to buy a double tap which means it gets two guns instead of one and now i shred even a lot faster by 
Harvester, I think it just uh, gives you a lot more money. Like I think like around a thousand dollars. But now I'm getting five hundred dollars uh, every forty-five seconds, which is pretty dope. And this thing just broke. Oh wait, I think it only does it. It does it only when it's killing zombies. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. So I just got free five hundred dollars from that tower. So I'm gonna start spamming a lot more of these, and yeah, I'll pretty much become a god. Actually, I'm gonna start farming myself. I guess that's what I should do. Uh, just gonna place it right here. Farm, uh, Farmzik did get nerfed, by the way. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure how much exactly. Yeah, uh, Orchard is now nerfed. Uh, it, the price was increased by $200. All right, Bobby guys, if you guys didn't know, there is also a 4v4 mode in here, which is probably in response to Tower Defense Simulator after releasing their own 4v4. Click veto, click veto, click veto. Zavita, click veto, click veto. This doesn't work, okay. Uh... I think he's gonna give us new maps. Oh wait, uh, do start now. Let's do start now. And then he's gonna refresh for maps, right? Yes, it's gonna refresh maps. Oh my god, yes. Boy, there's a new map. I don't care about that. Let's go into Vito. Give I forgot this is try out. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, um, this uh, this game sucks because it's starting to lag a lot. Holy crap! I think it was a Roblox server just being garbage. Well, if you guys didn't know, this tower has an animation where the gun blowback thingy, uh, where the, uh, fireball, I don't know what to call that, I forgot, uh, the bolt crap, uh, chamber thing, whatever you want to call it, because I don't know how a UMP works, but yes, that moves back and forth, which is actually pretty cool. This might be the first animated uh, tower in tower balls. God, Ryan, get out the way, holy crap, still my way, even though it's been a year. Uh, Alright, bye-bye, guys. <coughs> Uh, we are flame, gl uh, flame glitching and also freeze glitching at the same time. That is only achievable with the archer, because Planet never fixed that glitch for the fire tower for the archer. This used to be performable with the flamethrower, however, he fixed that, so you can no longer do that. So, you're kind of struggling, but Tower Balls no longer really lags anymore when there's a lot of zombies on the screen. But thing is that, uh, Roblox is really bad for me. I don't know why it's lagging so dang hard, but yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Just lags every second like that. Probably Ryan that doesn't get it, but I get it. Alright, new zombie by the way, super slows, which is pretty much a nerf version of the boss too, that's generally about it. They look like boss 3, but like, just more poor, I guess. Alright, right, Golden Commando got nerfed, and the price has increased by a lot, holy cow, it's increased by like 20 grand. That's our first boss 3, nice. Boss 3's are now clumped all together, and look at that, man, just, just like that, that's like 4 boss 3's, I think, nice. And they're all dying. Uh, I still did give the motors, but the thing is that they are nerfed. Uh, they do 40 damage per shot, so be aware of that. And the prices increased by a thousand, I think. Uh, here's what the max huntsman looks like. It holds two two honey badgers, and has a little a little cigar, and you get a thousand dollars every 35 seconds. So this tower is actually really well worth it. Put a new honey badger. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Out from Max Commando is now fixed. Uh, the arms no longer fall out, and the platform actually spawns in correctly this time. Boy, Roguners are buffed. They were buffed like 50 damage, I think, or something like that. Uh, so if you, I lost connection to Roblox, so I just waste all my time grinding for this view. Nice. I keep losing connection to Roblox for no reason. Go? I disconnected. I left the game. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna leave the game in a bit, but I disconnected. Nice. I wasted. A lot of my time, I, I, I was about to get to wave 40 as well, and I lost, there we go, nice, relax, nice job. Okay guys, I will make another video specifically on wave 39 and wave 40 for the new void, the new guardians that spawn with the void, and stuff like that. But uh, for now, I did showcase the plaza trooper tower for like a few seconds, it's kind of buggy right now, so I wouldn't really recommend using that. But yes, golden scout and golden commando are for sale, and... Husband Tower is only a tournament tower uh, grade, so be aware of that. Uh, I lost connection randomly, and I wasted 30 minutes of my life trying to get to the last wave. And totally would have gave you guys that footage, but I don't feel like doing that all over again. I'm really annoyed right now. But uh, yeah, be sure to play the game. Link is in the pinned comment if you forgot, or if you're just simply new to the game. Yes, this is um this is what Tower uh, Defense Simulator was based off of. Um, below natural, literally copy and pasted tower balls with the same exact wave layout up until like wave 35 or something crap like that. But generally, all the waves in tower defense simulator are the exact same copy from tower balls. Uh, it's just had different zombies, but still the same overall appearance and overall um health and stats. Cool. Okay. Bye. Enjoy tower balls. We can 
overthrow Tower Defense Simulator. We have a chance. We have a chance, guys. We have a chance to strike. The North strikes. <laughs>